Hello, my name is Eugen and I'm going to talk uh, now about uh, the inside the area of uh, the oil platform project. I was talking in the uh, previous part about the outside uh, platform area. Now uh, we are going inside. I have here the outside uh, area loaded. I will stop this and um, show this bar and uh, load the inside area. Now uh, we are going to be talking uh, a bit about how uh, the player can interact with the valves in this uh, room and also uh, we will show uh, a bit of uh, the GUI system, how we can uh, adjust, uh, change, add uh, or remove uh, elements uh, and then play and uh, see all the changes in uh, real time. I will uh, hide uh, the avatars. I'm going to play the scene and uh, start walking to the Volvi. The valve is uh, starting to um, release steam. I will uh, start all four of them. I need to look at the valve and press the E key and I will uh, make that. It will make the valve start or stop. This one I stopped it right now. I will hide this remote uh, camera window because we don't have any remote camera in here. Let me talk a, a bit about the GUI system. We have, uh, as it's shown, uh, we have uh, tooltips for uh, any elements of the GUI. Uh, this is very helpful because uh, we can have brief information about uh, each uh, of uh, the elements, what they uh, do or what, where they uh, point at. I can go and uh, select for example a new uh, screen effect, black and white. We see now uh, the scene uh, all in black and white. Everything is or either black or white. I'm going to select the default one again. Also we have options for uh, shadows, for example, uh, on medium details. Shadows are uh, a little bit uh, more clearer, but on high details uh, they are very clear and uh, uh, they can be seen uh, very easily here also. These are uh, soft shadows. Also is uh, the same implementation we used in the outside um, scene. I'm going to stop this one also. So we have all these uh, elements of uh, guy. How we can? How can uh, we create this guy? How uh, did we do it? We go to the resource area, go to the guy area, and uh, here we have uh, uh, the GUI elements, all the GUI elements uh, into the project. We have two sheets: uh, the main menu sheet, which uh, shows when the project starts, and the player HUD sheet, which uh, uh, shows when we enter the playing mode after we res resume the, the main menu. I can show the main menu for example. I can select this uh, and uh, choose another configuration for it. Now uh, if I'm playing the application I have this configuration. Everything happens uh, the same uh, it happened until now but um, the menu is uh, looking differently. Note that uh, we don't have to save uh, nor uh, do any other uh, things uh, before uh, seeing this into the game. I just uh, needed to, to press the play button and uh, everything uh, from there looked uh, the way we arranged it. I'm going to stop this. Uh, go to the player HUD. Uh, this is the player HUD uh, configuration. I can add for example a new window. This is a new player window. I can put my uh, controls in here. I will add uh, a push button, a check button and uh, 
în edit box and I can place them uh, anywhere I, I want it. I can also see their uh, properties, set their properties and adjust their uh, um, size. For example, uh, I will call this push button, go to scale and uh, scale it, then uh, automatically pressing the space will uh, go to move to position and I can position this button uh, directly also yeah, again I can scale it and position it. Selecting this other button check box I'm going to scale this a bit so I can see the whole text. I can also select uh, all three elements and position them uh, into the window. Now I'm going to set this window to be transparent and uh, run the application again. The application uh, has started. I resume the application. I have this uh, window here. I can position it anywhere on the screen. I can check this. I can write here anything I want or delete or uh, any, anywhere I want. Then uh, I can push the button. We need to write some uh, scripted code if you want for this button to do something into the engine. Or we can write C++ code as we did it with uh, all the other uh, menu parts. Uh, all the other guy uh, elements we have uh, into the project. This, this is it about this uh, uh, interior uh, room. Um, the next uh, part of this uh, presentation will be about um, uh, real-time uh, playing uh, of these scenes uh, and this uh, project. Thank you.